What's up guys, Tekshan here back with another video. After testing the ASUS Zenfone Max Pro extensively, here is a super quick video with its pros and cons which will help you with your buying decision. I have already covered most of the things in my overview video so make sure to watch that, we'll leave a card. Alright, let's start with the pros. Design and build, it's solid and sleek. Next is its triple slot which can hold 2 nano SIM cards and a micro SD card. Best part is you get dual 4G VoLTE support, 2 Geo SIMs in the same phone, yes possible. Call quality is excellent. Coming to the display, the 5.99 inch Full HD Plus 18-9 display is one among the best in this range. Good color reproduction and viewing angles. Next Performance and Gaming Latest Snapdragon 636 with 3GB RAM and stock Android Oreo handles most of the stuff you throw at it smoothly. RAM management is good. If you are a heavy user, I would suggest go with the 4GB model. Here is the benchmark score. On the gaming, it handled most high-end titles with ease like Asphalt 8, Nova 3, Spider-Man very well. No heating issues was under control. Next up, the 5000mAh battery which in my practical daily use, I got max 2 days. Pretty impressive. On the sensors, no compromise except NFC. Next is the audio output via speaker and 3.5mm slot, it's loud and clear. You get an amplifier to boost the output, watch my unboxing video to know more about this. Next the rear camera, takes nice shots with details. Have done an extensive camera comparison which you should never miss even in your dreams, so make sure to check it out, we'll leave a card. Finally the pricing, for 10999 it's a good buy. Checks on most of the points you expect from a mid-range smartphone, plus the flip cut protection plan for 49 rupees is a boon. Now to the cons. The front facing camera is disappointing, could have been better. Fingerprint sensor is slow, no Gorilla Glass protection. Finally lack of fast charging, charging takes 2 hours 45 minutes, not slow though, ok for the battery size. Now to the most asked question, should I buy this or the Redmi Note 5 Pro? If front camera is not your top priority then the Max Pro offers better value for money and you should go with this. So that's my take on the Zenfone Max Pro, like, share and subscribe and we'll catch up in another exciting video, until then.